different commissions within the Senate dealing with women issues, environment issues, education issues, and development issues uh, to address the issues that are expressed in the Manila Declaration and to include this into their programs of work. For example, the Minister of Education included dentro de las programas académicos programas de prevención en los problemas climáticos y políticos públicas para la protección de las mujeres. For example, uh, for the Ministry of Education to include the issue of uh, gender climate change in the curricula. Al Ministro de Medio Ambiente también que se incluyen en sus programas estos temas to the Ministry of Environment so that he will mainstream and consider gender considerations in his programs. A los países que ya lo tienen en sus programas, revisarlos para conocer si realmente se cumplen. In those cases, uh, those ministries that have included gender considerations to evaluate if they are achieving the goals that they have stated. Recomendamos a los organizaciones que están aquí representadas que se existe otra oportunidad para participar a este tipo de reuniones es necesario que tengamos una persona que nos traduzca en nuestro idioma lo que aquí se desarrolla y a que nos hemos podido expresar nuestras opiniones y experiencias paramentarias como hubiéramos deseado. To the organizers of the event, we will request that in the future that translation is provided uh, since we have had limited capacity to interact and intervene in the sessions. Por ejemplo, francés, español, eh, español y portugués. For example, Spanish, French and Portuguese. Felicitamos también a los organizadoras por facilitar a todos los participantes la elaboración de esta declaración. We want to thank all the organizers of the event for um, developing the declaration. Sabemos que cada país tiene sus propios problemas, algunos diferentes a los demás otros ecuares. Uh, we know that each country has its differences. Pero esta declaración expresa el deseo de todos los países en mejorar la calidad de vida de todas las personas. But this, in this declaration we express um, the wish to improve living conditions of everyone. Nosotras, nosotras, nosotras para, paramentarias, tenemos la responsabilidad de incorporar en todas las leyes estos temas. We as, que, we as parliamentarians have the responsibility to mainstream and incorporate these type of issues in the laws that we pass in our countries. Y que todo esto se concrete en acciones para tener un mundo mejor. Muchas gracias. And that this will become into actions for a better world. Thank you very much. We still, we have two more, from, one from Europe and North America, Senior Policy Division on Gender of the GTZ, Germany, Dr. Angela Langenkamp. I must make a confession, I'm not Dr. Angela. Uh, I'm Ines Smith uh, from Oxfam, and uh, we have worked on this together with a group uh, from um, North, and North America and Europe. Uh, first of all, we wanted to, to join our thanks to the organizers for such a timely conference, and especially for their uh, hospitality. We try to be pragmatic uh, in uh, uh, 
coming to an agreement on what our actions will be on our return to our respective uh, homes and institutions. So, um, following the conference, we intend to disseminate the declaration to policymakers, and especially to those in ministries, uh, relevant ministries, such foreign affairs, environment, Ministry of Justice. We also want to hand the declaration um, to the heads of the delegations to the UNFCCC, um, to the participants in the processes, demanding that they take actions so that the contents of the declaration are carried over into the legal regimes and programs that we'll be discussing. And uh, obviously we need to do this in a timely fashion as the process is very advanced and will accelerate in the, towards the, the spring. We also intend to present the declaration to the gender and other relevant committees in the various uh, parliaments represented in the group. We also would like to use the text of the declaration to inform um, other policy influencing documents and events of the various institutions we represent. Um, we plan to organize specific events uh, such as roundtables with various actors, whether it, um, NGOs, women's organizations, um, and those working specifically in climate change and uh, disaster risk reduction and beyond. Thank you. Thank you, Ines of Oxfam, the first imposter who immediately admitted that she is one. Okay, uh, finally, we would like to hear from our representative of the Pacific, President of the Hako Women Collective, Bougainville Women for Peace and Freedom, Papua New Guinea, Ms. Hona Holland. on behalf of the Pacific Delegation. Why is gender an important consideration in the context of adapting to climate change and disaster risk management in the Pacific? One, it is well acknowledged that because the economies and small communities of Pacific Island countries are highly dependent on natural resources, they are more vulnerable to the impact of climate change and associated increase in the occurrence of natural hazards. Despite the vulnerability of Pacific Island countries to the impact of climate change and disasters, research shows that women and men of Pacific Island communities have successfully utilized specialized knowledge of their environment to mitigate disasters through the management of their natural resource basis for generations. They have done this through a variety of traditional and cultural practices that have been maintained through informal education and oral traditional across generations. These include food preservation, housing construction, traditional system of exchange, and most importantly, the management of all natural resources. Studies indicate that women and men have different skills and knowledge that can assist in adapting to climate change, preparing for disasters, and reducing disaster risk, stemming from gender division of